Greetings in the name of the Most High, Yehovah, to all Israelites all over the world and in all the nations. I am a Jamaican, a Hebrewess, as God calls us females. Some people call us Jewess, or when I was even smaller and in primary school in Portland, they used to call us Negress. However, we can call ourselves what we want. I'm from the tribe of Judah, and I bring you greetings in the name of the Most High. Today we are going to look at the name of the God of the chosen people, who are the 12 tribes of the nation of Israel. We hear a lot these days that we are all I as children, and we all serve the same God, and that is a lie taught by our enemies. So first we're going to look in the book of Exodus, and that is chapter 3. And I'm using the King James Bible, the 16 edition, 16 level edition, and it is written by the Most High through his prophets, and he gives us his laws and his commands, and that edition was authorized by King James who was king over England, Scotland, Ireland, Wales, and France at the time. He was a black king too, and he was an Israelite king. I'm also black, and I'm an Israelite from Scottish origin. And in verse 3, I'm, I'm sorry, verse 13 of chapter 3, And Moses said unto the God, unto God. Behold, when I come to the children of Israel, and shall say unto them, The God of your fathers has sent me unto you, and they shall say to me, What is his name? What shall I say unto them? And God said unto Moses, I am that I am. And look at that, it's in all caps. And thus thou shalt say unto the children of Israel, I am hath sent me unto you. And God said, Moreover unto Moses, thus shall say unto the children of Israel, The Lord, the God of your fathers, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and the God of Jacob, has sent me unto you. This is my name forever, and this is my memorial unto all generations. So that is God's name. I am that I am. In Exodus chapter 6, and verse 3, his name also appears, and I appeared unto Abraham, and unto Isaac, and unto Jacob, by the name of God Almighty, but by my name Jehovah, I was not known to them. So God revealed his name to us. If that is not the name of your God, we do not serve the same God. In Psalms, uh, LXV11, at Psalm, in verse 4, it said, Sing unto God, sing praises to his name. Extol him that rideth upon the heavens by his name I are, and rejoice before him. In Jamaica, you see that some of us call him Yah, Yahweh, Aya, or Jah, because J sometimes looks like I. But that is the name of our God. If that is not the name of your God, we do not serve the same God. And then again, if you look in Psalm 83, LXX111, this is where the nations of the earth conspired to remove Israel as a nation. And if you look in verse 18, he says, that men may know that thou whose name alone is Jehovah art the most high over all the earth. So this is the name of the God of the Israelites. Jehovah or Yahweh is his name. That's it for today. Peace be unto you. And we are in the last days. Time to repent of our sins. To follow the commands, the statutes and the laws that are obtained in this Bible, and we use this Bible because so many of the other ones have been tampered with.